What's poppin' YouTube? It's your girl, Solitonia. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm bringing you guys my fifth sneaker pickup. And I'm actually really excited about this particular pickup because this is the first time in a long time where I actually picked up shoes on the release date. Like that shit never happens. So I'm just like really proud of myself. Like I never do that. I always like try to wait or whatever. I don't know why I try to wait and then they be like out of stock or whatever. Originally, I was gonna pass on these shoes, but these are the type of shoes that look a lot better in person type shit. Like, once you see them in person, you like, damn, them shit's nice. So, I picked them up, as you can see. My babies is chilling right here. So, because I was finally able to get my hands on a pair of shoes on the release date, I feel like I can finally do, like, a proper sneaker review because it just makes no sense to do a review on shoes that came out like months and months and months ago you know so I can actually do a proper review so without further ado let's just go on ahead and get into the video and also I posted these shoes on my snapchat so um, if you follow me on snapchat you would have already seen these so if you not follow me on snapchat then my nigga you need to follow me on snapchat because you be missing shit and I follow everybody back my nigga so you know Follow me on Snapchat or whatever. Okay. So these shoes are from the Air Jordan 5 Fall Collection. And I believe these were the last shoes um, from the collection to come out. These came out yesterday on September 30th. Today is October 1st. Of course, obviously, i already seen the shoes. This isn't like a first impressions video or unboxing video. I've already seen the shoes and reacted to the shoes. Um, so yeah. Let's just go ahead and open the box. So here is the little sticker. Of course, I got my shoes in a four and a half. I always get my shoes in a four and a half. And it says Air Jordan 5 Retro PG. The colorway is Game Royal slash Black Game Royal. And these retail for $140. So without further ado, let's just go on ahead and open up the shoe. And of course, I'm pretty sure y'all are not surprised that I got some more Jordans. I irritate myself with this shit too but these are really really nice like i can't even be mad at it and plus i just got me a pair of red suede shoes so it just makes sense to give me a pair of blue suede shoes you feel me so these are the shoes in the box as you can see a nice pretty royal blue all over so yeah it is a all suede upper in a royal blue it also has royal blue on the midsole the netting the laces and the eyelets of the shoe one of my favorite parts about the shoe is the black that they added to kind of give it a little bit of contrast so they added black to the sock liner and also right here and on the other side they added a little bit of black as well and of course they have the black Jordan sign on the tongue and the back of the shoe it has a translucent icy outsole which i really like and it pairs well with one of my other favorite parts about the shoe is the 3m reflective tongue this shit just looks nice as hell like especially like on picture when you take a picture of it even right now i feel like you can still like kind of see that it's reflective but of course i'll give you guys a better look at that it just adds a little extra something something to the shoe like i feel like if the shoe didn't have the 3m tongue um then i probably wouldn't mess with it as much as i do but these shoes are really nice especially in person these are the type of shoes that you have to see in person to really see how nice they are because when i first seen these online i was like man that thing's is right. but once i seen them in person i was like oh hell yeah i'm getting these so most definitely um i am definitely happy with my purchase um i really want to do it on foot i just really don't know if it makes sense for me to do an on foot and I only have one foot right now because as y'all know I'm still recovering and I'm still wearing a boot um so I didn't do an on foot for my last sneaker pickup which I usually do uh but if you guys still want to see an on foot then just let me know it would just be using the left shoe which is kind of whack but you know just let me know if you guys you know want to want to see an on foot or whatever and I'll have no problem doing it but only if it makes sense y'all of course it has a little shoe tree on there or whatever says the little retail price um and the insole is just a regular black insole with a blue jump man so 
yeah guys that is pretty much it for this review really quick you know a uh, simple shoe so there's not really much to it y'all know like i always say i always get shoes that i know that i can pair with a bunch of outfits and you know i'm just gonna be cripping it you know for a little bit right now i got on my suede reds and now i got these so i'm really happy with my purchase show you both of the shoes side by side the lighting that i have now these are just so cute so icy i love the translucent bottoms with the 3m tongue i love the blue on blue so i really really like these a lot so that is pretty much it for today's video i really really hope you guys enjoyed if so be sure to let me know by liking this video and let me know if you guys picked up these shoes if you did let me know how you feel about the shoes and if you didn't pick up the shoes let me know why also of course subscribe to my channel if you haven't already all of you guys can follow me on instagram and twitter at Sully tonia and my snapchat is tonia underscore 15 until next time y'all stay black if you're not black stay blessed and i'll be seeing y'all in my next video Bye. Riding around the city with some brand new heat, brand new car, brand new feet, brand new seats, brand new smell. Put out the roach light a brand new L. Fuck you, bitch, and make a brand new. Fuck you, bitch, my shirt brand new.